up? Welcome back to my channel. Tara here. Oh, there's a, like a little... Hold on. How's it going, guys? Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm doing a haul video for fall. A fall haul. I love the way that sounds. I haven't filmed a video on this camera actually in a long time. Let me know if you can notice the difference and then maybe I'll go back to this one if you prefer it. Otherwise, let me know and then I won't bother. But we have a bunch of things here. I am wearing a very big sweater without pants, so we're just... <laughs> We're gonna ignore it. I know you can kind of tell because like my leg is exposed. I have my chai tea latte in a cup that says Hawaii, so love that for us. But I think we should just get into it because I have a bunch of stuff scattered all over my bed. You guys have no idea the disaster it is that filming hauls is. It doesn't really make grammatical sense, but that's okay. It's just a disaster. Everything is everywhere. But if you enjoy this video, make sure to subscribe to my channel by clicking the little red button down below and click the little bell next to it so that you can be notified when I post. I want to start doing like comment of the videos so leave me a comment down below with anything you want and then in the next video I will do a comment of the day at the beginning. I think that'll be fun. But yeah, so let's just get started I guess because why are we rambling? Okay, we're gonna start with Show Me Your Moo Moo because I just recently went to a gifting suite from them and they gifted me all of this which is so awesome. This sweater that I'm currently wearing is from Show Me Your Moo Moo. It's just like USA. I don't know if anyone's already called me out for being Canadian, but like I know I'm Canadian, but it's just a cute sweater. So I have a few things here. We have this sweater. Just the front and the back. I love this sweater so much. It's just like the perfect fall color. It's all distressed at the bottom, if you can see that. Got all these little frays, and then at the top too is a little bit, it's like someone cut into it. So cute and oversized and comfy. Great for those cooler nights. Obviously I live in LA and it's not cold during the day a lot of the time, unfortunately, but it's great for nighttime. Okay, this is inside out going. Then we have this sweater. It's a very similar color, but a little bit more of a mustardy, dark mustard, I don't know. It's very soft and comfy, and then it has this knot at the bottom. So cute with high-waisted jeans, like black high-waisted jeans. Then we have this pair of pants. These are really cool. They're very like out of my comfort zone, which I think is good, and I'm trying to branch out a little bit more. They're just these kind of plaid pants downtown LA. So they're just like long pants. They're very baggy and then I cuff them at the bottoms which I think works especially because I'm shorter. Very cute and comfy and like perfect with like a black simple top I think. Next I have a sweater from Madewell that I picked up. This is so cute. It's just like a regular knit but it's like a nice sweater and it has like the balloon sleeves. The sleeves aren't like too much in my opinion. I actually wore it to a pumpkin patch over a little skirt that I have. I thought it was really cute. Moving on we have a couple things from Brandy Melville. They're all basics. FYI. Actually one of them is not so basic. Basic AF but we like it. It's just a car. The back says Motor Show 1984. I was not alive then. I don't know. I just liked it. And then yet another basic. This one I think is a little less basic but it's definitely basic. Just this little long sleeve with the stripes. There's something about France 1990. Still not alive. And then lastly I just got this little cheetah shirt. So cute. I love that this trend is in right now. I'm obsessed with it. I actually have a photo of me wearing this on Instagram and I love it. I got so many comments being like, where is that from? By the way, I will have links to everything that I can find in the description, so make sure you go check that out. Moving on, I have a couple things from Zara. First thing I have is this jacket. It's just one of those denim jackets with like the wool inside. I was actually shopping with my mom when I picked this up and she hated it. She was like, it's 280s. I could never, but I was like, mom, you just don't get it. She should get it because she's very trendy, but this she just couldn't get on board. It's definitely thicker, so I can't really wear it that often. Hoping it gets cool soon. And then I got this sweater, which I wore the hell out of when I was in Toronto visiting my family because it's just so great. <laughs> it's just like this cream sweater with all these little polka dotties on the front and the back, actually. It's oversized, perfect with leggings, perfect with jeans, perfect with everything for the fall. Like this sweater is everything. Cute. What's next? Um, I have a couple things from Shop Redone. They are great. I have these jeans. They actually sent me these, which I'm very grateful for. These jeans are amazing. They're definitely a little bit out of my comfort zone as well, but I've been trying to wear them a lot. They're just like a regular light wash. Actually, fun fact, I bleached these myself. They're a little bit darker and I really wanted a light bleached jean look, so I did it myself. But they're a little bit baggier on me. Like the, the leg is more of a straight leg than a skinny and I'm used to wearing skinny jeans, but I really like it and I like how distressed the ends are. I actually also did this myself because they were too long on me because I'm only five feet tall. So then I have a shirt that I've worn also the hell out of and I'm sure you've seen it a million times on my Instagram. It says, easy come, easy go. It's really soft, like their shirts are really comfortable and that's my favorite part about them. Um, next up we will do 
Topshop, yes. I have this jacket that I've also been loving lately, and it is just this camo jacket, as you can see. I think a year or two ago, I also bought a camo jacket, but I couldn't commit to the trend. I just thought I looked so weird in it, but this jacket I feel really cool in. You should definitely have clothes that make you feel cool. This makes me feel cool. Camo, and it's also cropped and a little distressed at the bottom. I don't know if you can see that. I love it. It's perfect with everything. It's just like something easy to throw on. I, I love it. I'm obsessed. I also got this little sweater. It's very simple and basic. It's like almost like a cashmere feel. This is it. Just like a little tan cream sweater. I like it. That's all I can say about it. Then we have a couple things, a few things from Urban Outfitters. The first thing is this little shirt. It's a graphic tee and it's obviously Disney characters. I got this for a Disney trip that I went on a few weeks ago and it was just perfect. It's the perfect graphic tee for a Disney day. And it's very like washed and vintage looking, which is really, really fun. And I like that everyone's wearing a lot of shirts like this lately. I just, I like the look of it and I think it's really easy to wear. Then I got this little shirt, also inside out. Yay. I got this on sale, so I don't know if they're still selling it, but I will try and link something similar in the description. It's like this mustard colored top, and it's just like, you can kind of tell there's like ribbing down the front of it. It's just a really nice fit, and it looks great tucked into jeans. Lastly, I have this sweater that everyone's been asking me where it's from, and it is from Urban. Look how cute this sweater is. I love the stripes, and I love the colors of it. It's just like the perfect fall sweater. I absolutely had to have it when I saw it in the stores. Just waiting for a cold day here. Once again, LA. If you want to cool it down, Los Angeles, please do so I can wear my sweaters. Last up, we have a few things from Nasty Gal. I will show you these shoes first. How fun are these? I showed them to my mom and she was like, well, they're a look. And I was like, that's an insult, I think. So thank you. But I don't care. I like them anyways. I think they're very cool. They have stars on them. They're just like funky. They're different. And I, you guys know, I wear only black shoes. So black with something on them, it's a little different. Get them a little crazy. I love those though. And then I have one of those like leopard cheetah skirts. I have not worn this yet, but I do plan on wearing it. I think it's really fun. I don't totally know how to style this and it's definitely bold, but I like it a lot. This is a work in progress. There's also a little slit. You see it? It's over there. And then I just have a couple of white tops. I have this little crop. Cute. And it has like um lacing down the front of it. It's very stretchy. Look at that thing. Yeah. And then lastly, I have this bodysuit. It's a little wrinkly because it was just in my suitcase. But it looks like this and it ties. That is my haul. That is everything. I hope you guys enjoy. It's getting really warm in this sweater because I'm right in front of the window and it's hot and uh, it's a lot. So it's going to have to come off. But I hope you guys enjoyed this little fall haul. Let me know in the comments what your favorite thing from this haul was. And also let me know what stores you like to shop at. I love to online shop. So if you have any online stores, that's for me. I love you guys so, so much. And I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to subscribe if you have not already. And I'll see you in the next one. Mwah. Bye.